it's not the we house. You know that we've been through this before. They will follow us. Getting paying money to get scared, man. What is, what is that all about? Because people love it. <laughs> I know. I have friends yeah. though who can't. Not yeah, very, so, yeah some people are like, no way. I'm not saying that. Yeah. Yeah, Quite not going to happen. Not, Freaks me out. Can't yeah. do it. Won't sleep. Ruin my I think some week. people yeah. like the... This, so, and then you know, I have family members that are just like, like, like see every single one. Really? They just love <laughs> feeling fanatical. like, you know, I don't know if it's like a loss of control. Mm. You know, being surprised. There are very few surprises, <laughs> just in general. In <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, in ge- no, in general, there are, you know? there are very few surprises. Yeah. I guess that is, that is a good thing. And yeah. this is the rare horror movie that's like a sequel that picks up right where the last one stopped. That's, that's mm-hmm. sort of unique, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, really. Yeah, it's we're in the same outfits, <laughs> the same flannel, same, same flannel. weird it's long is- duster <laughs> cardigan. <laughs> Uh, same the kids, man. I was, you know, wondering whether the children, because it had been two years, I guess, and I was like, they're gonna look too different, because that's such yeah. an incredible like, age, you know, growth. Right, there. especially for kids. For two kids, years is like yes, twenty. Radical, yeah. yeah. But we were lucky. They, we got lucky. Well, yeah. yeah luckily, uh, uh, no offense to the young men. Luckily, still prepubescent. Totally. <laughs> we were the voices in check. If we cast them at like yeah. twelve, and then yeah, now they're like would have right, right, it would have been just, yeah, would done. Be done There's no way you could do what? it. Mom. <laughs> Just yesterday, I was in Puma. <laughs> but talk about talking about this is. Talk, <laughs> long arms. Like, really uh, but talk about James Wan. I mean, this guy is incredible, man. He's like yeah. he owns an entire genre. That doesn't, yeah. that, doesn't ha- that doesn't happen often, man. Well, and he's yeah. constantly pushing himself. I think, which is really sort of, um, which is really admirable. I mean, even within the genre. I mean, the difference of like say Saw to. Uh, you know, well, I guess just to Insidious. Um, and then to The Conjuring. The conjuring yeah. and, you know, and in Dens to Chapter 2, I mean, he's yeah. he pushes even within that genre. I, I think that's the thing where now he's just like, okay, I've done it. <laughs> like, yeah. okay. he's gone as yeah. far as he can, like, yeah. right. do the fantastical element that's in this, yeah. you know, and the sort of the realistic, you know, mm. old school, school exorcism kind of stuff and Conjuring. And, you know, so he yeah. he's constantly pushing himself. I think which is probably what keeps him so... Invested in it that he's um, he's got the skill set, but also the sort of knowledge to just. And that's 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 to be fun for you guys too to work with somebody who sort of has that that vision and that. Drive. Totally, and he really, he's just enthusiastic with uh, infectious with his enthusiasm, and he really wants to be there. You know, yeah, like he, he does. just like, lives and breathes breathes cinema. He's a real cinephile. And, yeah. You know. What's wrong? What's the matter? You can tell me. I had a bad dream. Sorry, what was that about? I was in my bed sleeping. Grandma walked in. I could see someone else in my room. Please don't leave us again. Burn. Mm-hmm. I tried to wake myself up. It took a while, but I did it. I heard voices in the hallway. You've got to go. You have to go. It was Daddy. You have to. And he was talking to someone. You have to go. There's something wrong with Daddy, Mom. It's kind of like you guys like he's got his he's got his click going because how many you've done a couple movies with him now? Three. Yeah. Yeah. He's got, he's got the old Orson Welles ensemble thing going. Yeah. No. He's he. Yes. We've done. Yeah. He does. Done which two, is nice. Three. Yeah. It's rare. Not all directors. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I you know I think a lot of people. Um, I don't know. They're all they're they're they're. It's funny because he's just he's one of those sort of special kinds of people that, that not only has the, the focus to want to, uh, you know, know how to make the movie he wants to make, but he's also, um, he's very collaborative and, you know, working with Lee, he's known Lee for such a long time and, um, and on other, you know, a conjuring that, that he and I did together, you know, so he's, 
it's always what you want in a director and sometimes you don't get. To have the focus and the drive to be able to, you are helming the ship, this is your movie, but then even within that, you know, the, the, the advice, the input, and the, and the help, and the collaborations. So he's a very collaborative guy, which is also... Well, he's making a lot of people happy by scaring them to death. <laughs> <laughs>